Hello and here we are today and we're going to be comparing dry brushing techniques with paint washes. So here's a couple of Celtic plaques and we've used the same colours. So the colours being used are identical, we just went about it in a different way. So one of these is using paint washes or a paint wash with a dark colour, not quite black, a kind of mixture of black and brown and the other one's a dry brushed piece. So as you can see, they're both the same object, which is a Celtic design, which actually you can see how to make one of these on the channel. So like I say, two different techniques, dry brushing and paint wash. Be interesting to hear what you prefer, either the paint wash or the dry brushing technique. So I won't tell you which one's which, but some of you will probably be able to guess. So go on with the video and we'll show you both the techniques. So here we go.
So there we are, that's uh, the video on um, comparing dry brushing with paint washes. At the beginning of the video, I showed you both these plaques in their finished state. And uh, you would have been correct if you guessed this one was the paint wash. And this one was the dry brushed piece. And like I say, the colors used were the same, exactly the same, the dark color. We, we just used a, an acrylic dark color and an acrylic metallic paint of silver and obviously employed different techniques to create these finishes. Sometimes it's quite nice to do a wash and then highlight the areas with a dry brush so you get, um, you can create uh, different kinds of effects. So just a basic video for those that are interested. That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you soon and over and out for now.